is Grace and today I am going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is 23 chapter The King The Wise King Solomon Chapter 1 King Street Hooray! King Solomon shouted the people. Solomon became a new king of Israel. Solomon obeyed God and loved God and obeyed David's teaching. Solomon worshipped God with a thousand animal. He had Gibeon. So King Solomon was David's son. I guess and they King Solomon loved God and obeyed God and he worshipped God. God knew Solomon loved him. God told him in his dream ask for Anything what you want, Solomon. Solomon asked God, I want to know the difference between right and wrong. Give me wisdom. God was pleased with his answer. Solomon didn't ask for a long life. He asked for wisdom. I will give you of wisdom. I will make you rich and I will make you live long. If you follow me, God bless Solomon. So Solomon loved God and also God knows that Solomon loved him. So, God said that I will give whatever you want. But, like, oh, sir, Solomon asked for wisdom for his people. Solomon didn't ask for a long life and being rich. And he asked him for a wisdom. Like, if I was, if I was Solomon, maybe I will ask for something, not like wisdom for another people. One day, two mothers came to Solomon. This is my baby, said one mother. No, this is my baby. So one day there were some people. And one day, one day, Two mothers came to Solomon and said that this is my baby and they fight a lot. They are kissing, it is mine. No, it's not yours. You're the false mom. Like saying, yeah. Mm. Who do you think who is the real mother? Let's see in the next page. <coughs> we live in the same house. We both have babies. One day, one night, the baby 
died during the night. And the, another mother switched the baby. Two mother agreed. King Solomon said, Bring me a sword. The king's men were confused, but he brought the sword. The king ordered, cut the living baby and give half to one and half to another. So they live, oh sorry. Wait a minute. They live in a one house. And one day, they were sleeping. And the baby died. One baby died. So, the mother took this baby to his bed and switched the baby. But they don't know who have switched the baby because one of them is lying. And King Solomon said to bring a sword. Like, they were very confused because like, King Solomon just saying, like, bring me the sword. So they are confused, but, like, they listen to Solomon because he's a king. And, like, now King Solomon was saying, cut the living baby in half and give to one and half to another. No, said the baby's real mother was heartbroken. Don't kill the baby. Just give the living baby to her, said the crying mother. Good, said the other mother. So King Solomon got to know who is the real mother. So he, she is the real mother. So this baby will go to this mother, right? Mm -hmm. Wait a minute, it's so hard to draw those people in the top. Mm -hmm. It is hard to draw here. So the real mother said no, just give to the mother. But the false mother said, okay, that's okay. Don't kill the baby. Give the baby to the crying mother. Your king is real, really wise. The people were amazed. The people of Israel respect King Solomon. King Solomon ruled Israel with God's wisdom. The Israel lived happily and peacefully in Solomon's days. Yes, today I heard the Bible story. Did you enjoy? Then next time I'll read another good story. Then let's see you next time. Bye!